The middle of the map of this UHD is going to be kind of weird because it's kind of like Egypt. Uh, spoiler alert. There's one giant massive pyramid in the middle of the map. You might be thinking, okay, pyramid, cool. It's essentially a 3D triangle. What's cool about that? Well, you know what? We gave this pyramid a purpose. We removed all of the natural ores that spawn in the underground of the map. So that means if you go to caves, there will be no diamonds, gold, iron, lapis, redstone. Yeah, just no ores. And we essentially put all of the ores inside of this pyramid. So now it went from, oh, cool landmark, I guess, to I need this to live and win the UHC. So uh, yeah, we changed the dynamic of the game. Aw, uh, yeah. Anyway, sit back, relax, get some snacks, get some water, grab the number seven, and watch this UHC unfold. Be sure to sub and like because these UHCs take a lot of effort. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Intro done. Hi, welcome to the new UHC. How's your day? How you doing? Well, I hope you are. By the way, we are playing a UHC. Did you know that? Yep. And we are going to be experience the Great Pyramid, the seventh wonder of the world. Uh, but in Minecraft UHC. I mean, no, we're not quite in Egypt. Not really. Doesn't seem like it. But I mean, this is the closest we could get. In Minecraft, we have a giant pyramid at the middle of zero zero. And we need to get the stuffs real quick. We need to go get some wood. We need to get a bunch of apples. We need to get a bunch of stone tools for us to go to zero zero and just go straight into the pyramids. Obviously, I, I think I've mentioned in the intro already. Um, Hopefully, my future self mentioned it. That we could only get the ores in the cave. In the pyramids, not the caves. Because in the caves, we were removed all of the ores in there. There's no point going underground and trying to get some diamonds. There's no point in that because all of that's removed. We need to go to the pyramid and just grind the diamonds, grind the gold, grind the iron, grind all the resources that the pyramid has to offer. I'm currently trying to get some sugarcane right now because I can't really find anybody. I, it doesn't seem like I can't find any sugarcane right now. But good thing I have at least like two leather. Oh, is that sugarcane right there? I see it. I'm going straight towards it right now. I'm going to break this and that and give me the goods. Thank you very much. Come on, I would love to get an easy peasy book. So then that would get us closer to getting an enchantment table. That's going to be super nice. Yada, yada, yada. Bing, bang. Bada, bing, bang. Thank you very much. Here, you want some? I could give you some because I'm a nice lad. Okay, we're like 300 blocks away from like zero, zero. I want to go as soon as we can, as fast as we can. Oh, oh. speed run. Any percentage. Go, go. Oh, I see it. I see it. It's right there. It's hiding behind that mountain. I'm going straight towards it right now. Oh, I could see it from so far away. What the heck? All right, let's go around the mountains what this looks like and oh my god this is bigger than i expected holy crap oh my god oh no this is big this is a big pyramid okay yeah this is what the great pyramid looked like if you ever fly out to egypt this is actually what the real world scale looks like of it oh gosh here we go and we're going straight into the pyramid and guess what there's goodies inside of it i don't think this is probably what it is in real life but uh here it is oh gosh there's a lot of diamonds too and gold all right this is gonna be a grind fest this is just gonna be me getting as many resources as i can before the pvp timer is is down to zero because I need a PvP will enable in like 16 minutes and I want to get diamonds as soon as I can. There you go. Thank you, diamonds. Thank you very much. Bing bang. Bada bat bat bat. It's a wahoo moment right there. Let me try to get five and then go down to like the underground so then I could hopefully find some obsidian. Maybe even get some obsidian myself. Since this pyramid is so massive, there's always going to be gold and diamonds and iron here. So I could probably just leave for a quick bit and then come back once I got my enchantment table. That's like the only thing that I need outside of this pyramid right now come on two more diamonds for me please two more okay i just got my fifth diamond i already made that diamond pickaxe though i'm gonna go straight down you know oh 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 wow okay that's fine no worries there's like always gold there so it doesn't even matter i'm just gonna go straight down i'm gonna make a bucket just in case that's gonna be good for when i find the liquids that i need the obsidian obviously i think the lava lakes are gonna be pretty easy to find but i think i need to find some underground water i'm too impatient to go all the way back up and go to a river there's some water right here down here in this cave Okay, this is perfect. Yes, I hear some lava right here. This is gonna be so easy to get. This is like the easiest obsidian ever. Yes, okay. Very, very common resources right here. This is good. This is gonna get us our enchantment table and we're gonna go straight to like getting our enchantments and then hopefully we could get an anvil later so then we could get that combining of resources and items. Okay, we have our obsidian. We're good to go. I'm gonna go back up to the pyramid now. I'm Audi. There's no point. Do you see any ores here? Obviously not. There's no ores to be found at all. But good thing there's a pyramid above us where there's all the resources resources. We're going straight up, boys. Oh, we're back up on the pyramid area. Yes. Okay. We're hitting sandstone. Come on. We're going to hit ores in no time. Yes, we did. That was literally like no time. Okay. Well, here we are. We're going to just go grind for the next 12 minutes and it's going to be a nice great time. Hopefully we could have enough diamonds to get that full diamond, full armor of diamond gear. Plus maybe like, I don't know, like a sharp three sword. That'd be pretty cool. You know what? I'm going to go make them things right now. We're going to make them books. 
Ba-bam. And here comes the enchantment table right now. Boom. And now we could go enchant things. Aw, oh, yeah. We're gonna start with this book. What do we get? Protection one. This is a good start. All we need is an anvil to start like combining stuff. And I'm gonna just go grind for the next 10 minutes, trying to get as many diamonds as I can for that diamond armor. I don't know if I want to go for sharp three diamond sword. Possibly just iron, but who knows? We'll see. Okay, we could at least start on making our anvil right there. One good step. There you go. We currently have like 11 diamonds. Uh, I guess we're like halfway. I think we're gonna be on a good note so far. We're on a good path to getting that full diamond by the time that PvP is going to be enabled. So we're gonna be fine. Now just keep in mind that everyone is sharing this whole entire pyramid together. We probably have the same amount of chance of getting full diamond along with all these other people. So I feel like a lot of people are going to get really good armor by the time that PvP will be enabled. It's gonna be slightly more stacked than normal in this UHC. People are gonna be pretty big on it. All right, enchanted some iron swords together. I'm gonna just boop that Woo. and boop that and do this yes we have sharp three so quickly this is so nice okay things are looking good i think we could maybe even get a sharp four if we really needed to i think it's possible we still have like six minutes before pvp oh combine 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 yes we have two sharp three swords okay we just need 10 levels that's it and then we could get that sharp four holy crap that's gonna be faster than i expected it's super nice and we're also currently at 19 diamonds we need five more to get full diamond and then we're gonna be fine we still got three minutes before pvp I think we'll be fine. Yeah, we're definitely going to get full diamond before PvP. This is going to be great. Come on, we need one more. Oh, okay, we got the diamond. All right, we have 24 diamonds. We could actually make this thing. Yes, okay, hold on. Let me just do the thing. Bada bing, bada ba, and full diamond. Yes, protection one, protection one, protection one, and ew, I don't want to go for project. I'll go for protection one, though. Yes, okay, we have full prot one. This is so super duper nice. We could also get the eight gapples right here. This is good. This is very good. I think to finish it off, we need to get... 10 levels, just 10 levels. We just need to find ores and that's it, nothing else. Preferably uh, maybe like diamonds and redstone for a good XP, but you know. What the heck? Someone just died. Someone died in a wall. <gasps> Someone just died in a wall. Oh my God, oh my God, oh God. Their stuff is just out there. It's like stuck in here or something. Where's their loot? Where's their loot? It's suspended somewhere, I know it. They died somewhere. I wonder where their loot went. What the heck? That's the most confusing thing in the world. Someone died in a wall, what the heck? Someone drowned. What is going on in my chat? People are doing very weird things in order for them to die. It's so strange. Oh crap, I don't know if I'm gonna get 10 levels before PvP. It's, I mean, it's possible, but we gotta rush quick. We gotta rush real quick. Come on, four more levels, 40 seconds. That's one level per 10 seconds. Come on. I don't know if I can do it. Oh, it's gonna be PvP. PvP will definitely be enabled by then. Oh, crap. No worries, no worries. I think we'll be fine. I think. Oh, crust. PvP is gonna enable right now. I'm gonna just put one of the things in my inventory. All right, here we go. They're starting. They're fighting. People are gonna start killing each other instantly. Woo! I'm gonna go gap up right now just in case if someone just gets up to me and kills me. Oh, God. It's so crazy out there there's so much going on i think the game is lagging oh i could hear the slaps out there very scary since it's so like tight packed down here in this mine shaft thingy inside the pyramid there's gonna be a lot of trades to be made let's just try our best to not like get slammed by somebody behind us or something that would be really really bad <gasps> oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh Woo. hi hello Hi, how you doing? What's up, man? Oh, oh, I think they dip. Holy crust. I wonder where they're at. Oh, what is this pyramid, man? What is this? Oh, goodness. Hi, hello. What's up, man? How you doing? Woo. Oh, this is so rough. The chase is on. Here we go. We're chasing a lot up a pyramid. This giant pyramid. This giant staircase looking thing, dude. Woo. Oh, Woo. oh my Christ. He has the uh, upper advantage. Uh. Oh, I'm going to jump. Got him. Got him good. Oh. Dude, this staircase is so strange, man. <laughs> we keep going up, man. Oh, 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 uh oh. No way, no way. Oh, I'm getting out of here. Oh, screw this place, dude. Oh, oh my goodness. How did I live? How did I live? Oh, it's so rough. Get out. <laughs> I poured water on him. Oh my goodness. Oh, go up, go up, dude. Uh oh. Woo! Yeah, we did it. We're out. Oh, no. Oh, the waterfall. Yes, it's crossed. Oh, my God. I think they left. Uh-oh. 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 Okay, I think we made it. I think we made it. Oh, my God. What a rush. What a massive rush, dude. No. No spoon feed, please. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm in, I am an independent woman. I am okay. I don't know why I'm eating it twice, but it's a thing. <laughs> Consider me just munching hard. I'm so happy I'm alive. I made it. I was so close to dying. I didn't even have any more healing. That would have been really bad. 
I kind of got a stalemate at the very first fight there, unfortunately. But I'm so happy that we're still alive. I'm gonna make sure that I have, like, a ton of gapples. Oh my goodness. Okay. There's just a random person that died here, apparently. Okay. I'll take their head. Thank you. That's a free G head for me. Okay, yeah, sure. Oh, there's so many people. Ugh. I accidentally dropped it. There's so many people that are still alive. What the heck? What even is going on, man? Okay, you know, I realized I still have this protection book. I'm gonna put that straight into my protection. One chest plate to make it into prot two. We're good. Kind of want to grind a little bit more healing right here. So then we could just be a little bit more established on the healing department. In that first fight, the lad was just using top ground advantage. If you're at a higher altitude, you have an advantage to hit people out the staircase down the pyramid. But then you could use it fall damage and then they'll just get even hurt even more. It's a very interesting strategy when you're fighting on top of the pyramid. When you're inside of the pyramid, though, it seems it's pretty predictable. You're going to be down here underground. It's going to be really tight packed down here. And it's just going to be one big trade. It's going to be pretty hard for you to escape and maneuver around this underground area because the only places that you could be running around are these giant long corridors that people have already made. Hello. Hello. I fight you. Hello. Woo. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. Oh, oh, I got it. Oh, I just got a kill. Yes. Okay. That guy is a very unfortunate lad. He had sharp three, barely sharp three. I think prop four, maybe. Oh, he didn't make it. That's a, that's a ripperoni for him. That's a GG for us though. The kill board is insane. There's so many people that got kills already. Look at that. It's so quick, so quickly. There was so much potential of fighting and killing down here. We can go get that prot two right there. If I'm not mistaken, we could also get prot two on the boots right there. Good thing that all of the combining and enchanting is finally 1.8. So that's pretty cool on our server. Wink, wink. Apple dot world IP. Wink, wink. I hear a person nearby. We're getting closer. I got to be careful. Drew. Drew gets any closer. I will stab. I will stab. Oh, that sounds kind of weird though. We are 41 and two. Our healing is insane. You know, now that we have this sharp three and this sharp four iron swords, I think it's a good motivator for us to maybe get sharp five. Sharp five iron. It's going to be really nice it's gonna be the second best sword that we could get in this game and that's gonna be huge huge for melee huge for trading down here in the underground i think it's gonna be a good idea because since there's so much opportunity for us to get all these resources since they're so close together it's just right here right super available i think we could do it i think we could do it we have a lot of room to do this and make this happen we just need four sharp swords and that's it come on here's our second sharp three. Oh, we got sharp 10 or er, what we got level 10 now can we do it Oh, we got sharp four, our second sharp four. All we need to do is combine the two sharp fours together. And we just need 19 levels. Okay, I can make that happen. I'm determined. Yeah, sure. I could do this. It looks like we successfully made it to top 25. This is really, really good for placement. Holy crap. And the plus side that we're currently occupied to getting that sharp five, we're probably going to be even further, maybe even top 20 or maybe even further to top 15. We got this. Oh, we're going to make it. We're making it happen. Yes, yes. Yes! Yes! <laughs> we did it! Oh my crust, we did it. Yes! I hear somebody though. Who is that? Here's somebody nearby. Meetup is in two minutes, by the way. So this is gonna be kind of a scary situation. You're not gonna be allowed to mine during meetup, by the way. Oh goodness, they're fighting out there. Oh, they're slamming. They're going at it. Oh, Hasvik got it. I wouldn't be surprised if Hasvik has a sharp five diamond sword. Considering that he has so many kills already. Oh, it looks like Hasvik and Hacking are going at it right now. Oh my god. Holy crap. Hasvik is getting slammed right now. Oh my goodness. It's a trade battle right there. Wherever that place is at whatever they're doing out there oh god these are some kill board leaders too i mean Hasvik has 10 kills and hacking has six they're like big boys of the uh they're rhinos some brutes out there man they're still going at it look at them holy crap oh goodness meetup is gonna be starting very soon i'm gonna get out of here so then we can get some apples and when we get some apples then we're definitely gonna get more diamonds because we have like almost two three stacks of gold ingots there's so much potential for more healing here i'm gonna just get out of here i'm gonna try to mine outside oh meetup is here here it is meetup time and we get out of here Oh, we get outie. I'm going. I'm going. I'm outing the place. No more of this. I don't think I'm able to mine anymore. We break through. We break through. Yes. We're outside. We're top 20. Yes, we did it. Okay. We're doing some things, boys. Oh, yeah. All right. We have 11 apples right here. Let's see what we could do with it. Bada bing. Bada bang. And we got 25. Ooh. Ooh, we got 49 gold, actually. Okay. I think we could get a little bit more apples here. We have 51 apples. 51 gapples and two G heads. This is really huge. Oh, we're massive on healing. Healing does not even a factor anymore. It's whoever could drop each other. That's when you know things are going to get stacked. Things are are stacked. I'm gonna make that. I'm gonna hold 17 gold just in case we get any more heads. 
There's people dying out there. Holy moly. There's definitely a lot of people out there. I'm gonna enchant a bit of my armor right here just in case. I'm gonna make some backup armor just in case. We just gonna get screwed over. I think we're gonna be fine now. Hopefully. All right, I'm gonna go back to the pyramid. Holy crap, there's so many people that died. We really are doing really well on the placement. The only unfortunate thing is that we don't have any projectiles, which is gonna be bad for comboing. It'll make sense if we're gonna be inside the pyramid, but it's more likely for us to be outside of the pyramid instead of inside because that meetup is actually a thing now. Oh, we're gonna summit this pyramid. Look how far down it is. Oh God, the render distance. Let me turn it up. Oh, it goes so down. Oh goodness, there's a person right there. Oh! Woo! They're going for it, man. Oh, he's slamming people down. Get out! Get out! <laughs> Someone has knockback? Drew has knockback! Oh my god. That's gonna be so overpowered. You get thrown off that way. Woo! That's scary. That's actually a very, very smart move from him. Very good tactic. Very good weapon. Especially since we're at the very top of this pyramid thingy. I'm gonna go get a bunch of water here. Okay, let's just remove that now. I'm gonna make sure that I have extra water just in case if I ever get thrown out and I don't pick my water source back up. You could see people out here just vibing. You want a screeny? Screeny. Oh, top 10 screeny. <laughs> oh, we're fighting now. Up, 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 doink. Get tingled. Dang it. Oh, well, that's a kill and a half. Okay. They dead. Oh, they have one string. If I have one more string, then I will have a rod for myself. I wonder where their head's at. Oh, their head's right here. Okay. We can make another G head. I'm so glad I was holding my gold ingots from earlier. Okay. We got that thing. If I have one more string, then we can make it. Oh, yes. Projectile protection or whatever it is. Projectiles. Hey, hey, oh, oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh! 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 It's so painful. It's a never-ending falling of down. Oh! This pyramid is too big. It's a massive pyramid. Go back up. Go back up. Go down. Yes! Oh, you're so lucky to have a rod, dude. You're so lucky to have a fishing rod. Oh! I don't have any projectiles. Oh! You know what? I'm gonna go down for it. I'm going down for it. Screw this. Yes, we killed him. Oh, the execution has been made. Woo! Holy crap, we got the rod now. Yes. Oh no, I hear another person nearby. The voice is in my head, possibly. Oh, that's another G head right there. Bada boom. Yes. I'm gonna reclaim my altitude level of highness. Oh, oh, woo! It's Epirus. Oh, he's going up. I'm gonna slowly make my way back up here. Okay, this is good. We're at top six right now. Is there anybody near here? Okay, there isn't. I'm at the top right now. I'm gonna let these guys 1v1, let those guys 1v1. I don't know where the sixth person is at. I'm very confused where this lad is at. Oh, I think I see him. Oh, he wants to fight. I'm gonna say Shoir. Okay, let's go. Hello. Oh, he made the correct move of going upwards there. I'm gonna try to just hit him downwards. Yes, he's getting hit downwards here. I dropped my sword. Oh, he's so nice. Oh, no. The rolls have changed. Uh, ooh, ooh. All right, let's go. Come on, David. Come on, David. Oh, my armor's breaking a little bit. It's at its halfway point right now. I gotta be mindful of the durability of my armor just in case. If I get killed from broken gear, that would be really bad. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bang. Woo! Yes! Get out. Oh, that's how you could switch the rolls really easily. Just using the pickaxe maneuver. It's very useful. Oh, oh, the bow really hit the momentum right there. Holy crap. He's so low. Maybe I forget him down a little bit more. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh, we were so close. Come on. I'm going for it. Come on. We were almost there. We are almost there. Oh, oh, come on. Come on. Yes. We are going to get it. Oh, his armor. Woo! Holy crap. Oh, we got him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Oh my crust. Get a sharp four too. That was insane. Oh, he has so many gaps too. All right, I'm going back up. We're top three right now with four kills. This is really good. Oh crap, has been. Oh, he got him in the pill. The little teeny tiny hole. He got him. Oh, this is going to be a hard debate. Okay, should I rather have sharp five iron sword or should I have diamond sword sharp four? You know what? I'm going to go for the diamond sword. Obviously, it says 12.25 attack damage. It technically has more attack damage, but this has better crit damage. So I'm going to go for this instead because I want to go for more crits while fighting this lad. All right. <clears throat> That's some uh, trivia for y'all. If you don't play UHC, let's do this. Here we go. Oh, 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 <laughs> my armor, <laughs> it broke. Oh, 
It just snapped. Oh, and I just got through. I just got slammed out from the gravity. Not surprised there, but that was very, very good. Good strategy. He maintained the high altitude advantage like how we've done throughout this whole entire UHC. It's been done. So, uh, yeah. That was insane. That was a good UHC. I enjoyed it. It was great. I liked it. I liked it a lot. But, uh, yeah. That's the UHC. I had fun. Good strategy. Never realized how crazy the pyramid would affect the strategy in fighting in 1v1s. But, uh, yeah. There it is. Anyways, IP here. Twitter here. Discord here. If you have any UHC suggestions, please comment them down below. I'll be sure to look at them and maybe even do them. Who knows? But, uh, yeah. That's pretty much it. Bye!